Welcome to DriveWise Cars, my name is Stephen and this is our beautiful 2014 Mini Countryman Cooper SD Automatic. Finished in starlight blue metallic with white roof and white mirror caps. The mileage on this one is 25,582. In total it's had three owners from new and it comes with a benefit and reassurance of a fully documented mini service history. The specification includes 17-inch triangle spoke alloy wheels, a three-sport leather steering wheel with paddle shift control, and media pack, which incorporates satellite navigation along with the visual boost radio system. So, shall we have a closer look? Well, let's start off at the front. We'll make a small adjustment to the camera. There we go. And now we'll come down the passenger side or near side. And just take a moment to pause whilst we appreciate those beautiful clean lines as we meander our way towards the back of the car. And we'll just stop to have a look at one of those alloy wheels. There we go. I can also confirm on this one we have rear parking sensors. And there's one of them just peeping at us there. There are four in total. So there's no excuses for reversing into either anything or anybody. And as we come now down to the off side or driver's side, again, I'll take a moment or two to pause so we can admire and appreciate those beautiful clean lines and those very nice alloy wheels. As we carry on back where we started from. There we go. Beautiful. So that's the outside. Let's have a look on the inside, shall we? So I'll pop the driver's door open and we'll check out the door card, make sure that's in good order. And there we are, it most certainly is. And as we can see on the driver's armrest, we've got a bank of switches for the front and rear electric windows, a toggle switch for the electric door mirrors. And as we cross over to the interior, we can see we've got some beautiful gray cloth upholstery and sport seats and the driver's seat is height adjustable utilizing that lever or lever as i should say i beg your pardon we're not in america so i'll park myself inside and we'll have a, a closer look there we go so there we've got the three spoke leather steering wheel with paddle shift controls one on the left and one on the right sitting just above the steering wheel we've got a rev counter with a digital speedometer and there's the mileage 25,582. Now we'll just start the engine up as we move across to the center of the dashboard and then I can show you the visual boost radio system lit up in all its splendor. So here we can see we've still got the traditional mini speedometer around the circumference there but here we've got various options. So let's set off with radio. So if I press radio, sorry for waggling the camera about, I'm just trying to get rid of that horrible glare for you. Hopefully that's better. So we can choose whatever radio station we want to listen to. We've got DAB, AM and FM. Although to be fair in Blackburn, DAB is not the best. If we go back to the home screen, this is the section where you could Bluetooth your telephone. Here, We've got the navigation system and if i press that we've got a nice full color screen map to view we'll go back to the home screen and then this is my favorite part vehicle information so if we look at this and then click on vehicle status we can see we have a tire pressure monitoring system currently all four wheels are active which means that's good and they're all green so there are no issues with tire pressure in any of the wheels but I don't know, let's say you got a loose valve or a puncture. You'd then get a warning on the system, which would encourage you to visit this part of the visual boost radio. And you could then identify which wheel is the culprit that needs attention. And if we click down to service requirements, so on here, this is where we can check if there are any services due in the next, I don't know, few months. Um, so. At the moment everything's okay but let's interrogate each one as we go along. So the engine oil, that's due in October this year or in 10,000 miles. Brake fluid, that's due in 
uh, November next year. I'm losing me years there. Vehicle check. October 2026, over 36,000 miles. From brake pads, 36,000 miles. And rear brake pads, 37,000 miles. Let me go back to the home screen. Underneath that, we have a CD player and all the heating and ventilation controls, the fan speed on the left, we've got air conditioning, a directional wheel, wherever you want the air to be directed to, and here, the temperature. At the bottom, we've got a master switch to lock ourselves in, a sport button, and front and rear fog lamps. I'll just switch the engine off. We've also got twin cup holders. Here's the automatic gear stick. That's the control panel for everything to do with the Visual Boost radio system. And let's pull that up a bit more, that's better. So here we can see we've also got a USB and an auxiliary port as well. So that's the view from the driver's seat. If we move behind the driver's seat and we'll check out the door card. There we go. Absolutely gorgeous. As are the rear seats from this angle. And then coming around to the back to gain access to the boot on the Countryman, all we need to do, press the mini badge and lift. And this gives us access to a cavernous load space area. And as we look at the rear seats, we can see they will fold down independently of each other. So you can do them one at a time or a two thirds, third split arrangement. Now, one of the unique facilities of the seats on the Countryman is that the rear seats will slide forwards just as the front seats do. And if we continue now down the near side, we'll check out the near side rear door card. There we go. And the near side rear seats. Absolutely gorgeous, beautiful. And last but not least, well, here we've got the front passenger door card. There we are. And the front passenger seat. And just like the driver's seat, this one is height adjustable too. So let me summarize for you. Well, here we've got a 2014 Mini Countryman Cooper SD automatic, finished in starlight blue metallic with just 25,582 miles. It's had three owners from new, and it comes with the benefit and reassurance of a fully documented mini service history. The specification includes media pack, which is a sat nav and visual boost radio system, a three sport leather steering wheel with paddle shift controls, and we've got 17 inch triangle spoke alloy wheels to boot. Now, once I finish the video, our team will come in and they'll make sure everything's tipped up as it should be. And then it will be all ready for you to come and inspect and drive. If you've got any questions or you might be wondering what your car could be worth in part exchange, well, give me a call. My name is Stephen. I'd be delighted to help. And I do hope you've enjoyed the video and look forward to speaking to you very soon.